What's going on everybody? Welcome to this video. And in the last video I got a suggestion by Jay Natty. He said, this game's amazing, I'm buying it soon, and I'm dying to get it. Please build an inline four car. So, um I hope you're watching this and I hope you do indeed get the game, because this game is super fun. Um So I went ahead and actually built a trophy truck with an inline four. Give you a quick little rundown. It's got link suspension in the rear. Um, let me show you this real quick. Works pretty good. And then the front is just double wishbone suspension. Works really good too. Um, now I have a three-speed transmission in here. Might be kind of hard to see, but I got a servo, or not a servo, a stepper motor attached to a worm gear. That's first, second, and then third's way back there. So uh, this is much better than my last transmission that I built. And this thing is pretty fun to drive around, so let me go ahead and start it up real quick. So this thing's actually, it's pretty quick. Um, let me get a speedometer up real quick. Okay, so we have a speedometer now. Uh, we'll be able to see how fast we can go. So I'm going to go over one of these suspension tests real quick and just give you a quick little demonstration of the, how good the suspension actually works on this thing. So this thing, it doesn't have a ton of power, but it's decent, so. So suspension does work pretty good. Um, let me go over here real quick. All right, so we're gonna go over this little jump right here. As you can see, it lands it pretty nicely. Um, let's go towards here where there's more like dunes. Let's see how fast this thing can go over there. So that's second gear, third now. Go on 90. 100. We're just going to send it. It's not going to end well. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, that actually works surprisingly well. Okay. So we went about 100 before we hit the actual the dunes. So, this thing, it, it lands a little weird sometimes. Kind of like that. But when you do get it to land, it lands really nice and it's pretty satisfying, to be honest. So let's go ahead and hit a couple more jumps real quick. Yeah, it's, it just, it likes a nosedive, which is really weird because I've done everything to try to stop that. I've tried adjusting the rear suspension, I've tried adjusting the front suspension and putting more weight in the rear and nothing really seemed to help it all that much. Yeah, see, I just, I can't get away from that, which is kind of annoying, but... Here, let's, uh, let's actually go interior view. So you can see the uh, front suspension right up front. Because it's pretty satisfying just watching the suspension, honestly. So you can see the suspension. I got um, three shocks in the front because it just needed to be super stiff because this thing actually weighs quite a bit. So you can see a suspension doing its thing. And then in the rear. I have four shocks, also because it just needed to be super stiff, and I needed a lot of dampening to make this thing not bounce like crazy. Um, let's go ahead and actually try to get this thing's top speed. It might take a while, because this thing doesn't have a ton of power, but it's it's still pretty good. Alright, so we've reached 100, 110, 120, I actually don't know how fast this thing's going to go. Okay, so 127. That's not too bad. I mean, for a trophy truck, you're not going to be going that fast when you're hitting jumps, so... Pretty much the entirety of third gear is just... If you're just going across flat ground and you want to get somewhere quick, but other than that, second gear, you're pretty much using that just for jumps and stuff like that, but we're going to send it anyway. That was actually a really nice landing. But, yeah, no, this thing... It's pretty smooth. Except for the... In fact, it likes to spin out like that sometimes, and then it also likes to uh, flip over when you jump it, but... Um, yeah, so... I made this because of the suggestion that, that uh, Jay Natty put in the uh, last video of my, my Gearbox video. Um, it turned out pretty good. I spent a lot of time actually making this thing ride nice and making it smooth. At least as smooth as I could. Um... 
if you guys have any more suggestions, feel free to leave them down below, and I'll try to get to them. And um, this is just another quick little video showing off a little build, and um, I'm going to actually upload this to the workshop. So if you want to take a look at it, feel free to. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to drop a like if you like the video, and uh, please also hit the subscribe button if you want to. It feel, it's free, and it helps me out a little bit, and uh, I'll catch you guys next time.